Hi there! Have you ever wanted to hack the most secured website on the world? Well, go find another tutorial, because today we're gonna cover HTML. A, newest, a new series in my channel, and this is basically to help new people in HTML. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to keep it short and sweet, uh, 5 minutes tops, or 10. Um, but, yeah, uh, it will teach you HTML in less than a year, probably, depending on episode, you know, depending on when I post the episodes. Okay, but anyways, let's get started with HTML. First thing you're gonna need is that you're gonna need to find a code writer, HTML code writer, but before all that, actually, let me tell you what HTML really means. HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language, the ability to make your own website. So, let's head on over here. You're going to need two things for HTML, basically. Um, you're going to need your code writer, which is, for my choice, it's Text Wrangler. And uh, you're also going to need, yeah, there we go. You can download Text Wrangler from this website here. I'll put it in the description below. And you're also gonna take a look at W3 Schools. It's really nice, as you can see. This is where we'll be lifting most of the HTML stuff from, and we'll be putting it in our code, text wrangler code. So without further ado, let's get started. First thing we're gonna need to do in HTML is setting up your basic, uh, your your basic, you know, your basic code. So you're gonna need. Uh, HTML only uses uh, angled brackets, which look like this. Um, I can't zoom in though. Yeah, but uh, anyways, it looked like that right there. <laughs> and then um, if I don't know if you can see, you can't. I cannot. Um, I cannot put it. Cannot zoom in. Okay, but never mind. Um, yeah, can't do it. I'll fix that. But you're gonna need angle brackets, and then you're gonna need to type in. First thing to do is to specify your uh, specify your HTML code. So basically, if you wanna specify that this document is HTML, you're gonna have to put the angle bracket, and then type in HTML, and then close it. Remember to close it. It's the most important thing in HTML. If you don't close it, the code won't work. So, let's see, you got HTML, and then you're gonna need to close close the code. So you're gonna put a bracket, angle bracket, and then you're gonna put a slash to close it, and then bingo. So you got your two, uh, you got your two uh, two codes, um, well, one code, and then you got your two open and close things. So, first of all, you're also going to need to make a head. So, wait, but first of all, let's go ahead and save this. So, I'm going to save it, and then I'm going to put it to, um, yeah, I know Sam. Uh, I'm going to put it to HTML. Make sure it's .html. Don't tamper with this, and then just put in, like, my project, my first project or something. I don't know, whatever name. And then as you can see here, the, your code is uh, in line. The, uh, HT, uh, this text wrangler helps you specify the code, which one is uh, broken or which one is uh, able to run. So when it's highlighted, in my case which is blue, when it's highlighted, it will tell you that it's running. So that's good. And then you're also going to need to put a head. This is, um, so basically, in HTML, there are three parts of a website, right? So there's a head, the body, mostly the footer. And um, yeah, you're going to need to learn each of these. So, and then uh, after that, you don't forget to close it, actually. I'm going to go ahead and close it first. And then uh, enter. And then you're going to put your title. Now this is gonna name what the website is. So if you wanna make it like uh, say um, T Googly Coffee Meet or something, you can type in T Googly Coffee Meet. So hold on, let me. So T 
googly coffee meat. So that's gonna name the name the whole website thing. So it's gonna run properly. Now title and the head and that's it, you're about done. Next thing you're gonna need to do is you're gonna specify the body. So let's put the body right here and then uh, put it on the next line so that you can see it properly. And then now you're gonna need to type H, uh, type your word in but uh, let's, let's first see what the website looks like, okay? So if we open it up, you're gonna see it somewhere around here. If we open it up, double click it, it will, uh, for Mac, it will open Safari. I think for uh, Windows, they'll open it in Internet Explorer. But as you can see, there we go. We got myproject.html. There we go. It's nice. And because it's blank, of course, you're gonna need to, um, uh, it's, it's blank, right? So you're gonna need to type in. So let's say P, okay? Uh, the P means paragraph, and we'll uh, uh, as we progress, we're gonna talk about more of the uh, more of the you know text. But for now, let's just stick with P. P means paragraph, and you're gonna close it again. If you don't close it, it's not gonna run. You see. So let's let's type in uh, uh, T googly coffee meat. Okay, okay. So we save that, save that in, and then you go to your Safari and you're gonna restart. And as you can see, right here is your page title, your T Googly Coffee Meet, and there you go, your T Googly Coffee Meet. It's gonna be typed in there. Also, uh, here's a little extra thing. If you wanna say you wanna link your website to another thing, um, like okay, say say why don't we go go ahead and go to my YouTube channel website and I'm gonna show you something really cool. So if you put yourself a href, make sure you there's a space in between there and then you press the uh, uh, um, you know equal sign then you open and close brackets and then after that you need to close it and then uh, okay so I'm, I'm, I'm gonna show you this uh, and for the closing is a now, so let's say we have a random website here. Let's put put okay put let's put my my website here. Okay, so the home of triple fun people, and then you're gonna you're gonna put this in the you know open inverted commas, commas, and then you're gonna after that you're just gonna go say, uh, welcome to my website or something, and then let's save it. And then uh, we go back to our Safari, refresh. And as you can see, if we try to refresh, the thing won't appear. The, the code one won't run properly. Oh, wait, it does. Okay, never mind. <laughs> okay, it does. That's funny. <laughs> but you're supposed to close it anyways. I think, I think it's adapted anyways. So never mind. As you can see, it goes there. So it's cool. And then you can't go back. I don't think you can go back. Oh, there we go. You can go back. So it's it's uh so as you can see you got your first website running you got a link so yeah it, it's 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 awesome HTML uh, go ahead and have fun with it so I'll see you next lesson there's a new lesson every week so thanks a lot for watching this is Triple Fun Dust if you enjoyed this tutorial please go ahead and you know just subscribe and you know you, uh, maybe even comment or like I'm very happy to answer all your questions to the best of my abilities. So if, if you guys if you guys want some help, you can always put it in the comment section. So thanks a lot for watching guys. This is Triple Fun does signing off and goodbye.